Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Brooke from Bees Budgets. If you're an existing subscriber, thank you so much for joining me again. Tonight we will be doing our um, hashtag 2024 winner for a $10 Etsy credit to my Etsy, which if you don't know, I did just open an Etsy. So hop on over there and take a look at that. And also we are gonna close out the year and empty all of our money out of our binders and so that I can do um, a sinking fund video. So if that sounds interesting to you, grab your beverage of choice and a snacky snack and let's hop into it. Okay, so let's start right off with our 2024 um, giveaway winner. And so you're gonna have to bear with me. This is the first time I've <laughs> ever done this, but I think, I think we got it. All right, so I pasted the link and then the keyword filter for our end of our countdown was hashtag 2024 okay so we're going to continue we have a 72 comments all right so good luck to everybody let's pick the winner island lady 1698 yes yay and she said great video and i just placed my order in your etsy shop have a wonderful new year 2024 i'm sorry hashtag 2024 and um she did place an order and i just filled all my orders for etsy so that is amazing congratulations to you island lady and um, I will put my email down in my, actually, you know what? I'm gonna message you on Etsy and um, I will get that $10 credit to you. And so congratulations again. And thank you for everybody that joined us along with our um, countdown to, let me write this down just, just so I don't forget, even though I know it's Island Girl, but we're going to write it down just so we don't forget. So Island Lady 1698. Yay. All right. So congratulations to you. And now we will get into our removing everything out of our out of what we saved for 2023 and so we're just gonna start pulling out and then I'm just gonna set it up here for any challenges that have not been completed yet what I'm going to do is I'm going to I have so many challenges that I want to get to this year I have a new way that I'm going to be doing my binders I'm just waiting for a few of my binders and um, other items to get in the mail and I, if there's anything that I still want to do, I'm going to continue to do it. I haven't decided if I'm going to just reprint out the challenges that I want to redo and then clean off the laminated ones um, that weren't printed. I don't know, I haven't fully decided that yet, but I save for my sinking funds and so that's what I'm doing. I'm pulling all of the money out and it will go into my sinking funds because that is what I save for. So and I'm going to do my reset for the year and then I didn't get restarted until October. So all of these savings will be from October until January. So I'm kind of curious what I saved that entire time. That is exciting. All right, binder number one complete. And we have our roll the pigs. This one I am definitely playing again. I will just clean that tracker off with a magic eraser and just continue for the new year. That's how I think I want to do it. But everything is subject to change, right? <laughs> our budgets don't stay the same, so why should our savings stay the same? 
but I, like I said, always do all of my challenges for my sinking funds. I think in the new year I will have a couple challenges that will be dedicated to specific things that I want to get. I want to save for a new laptop. I love my laptop, but the screen is, I don't know, it's going kind of funky on me. Like the colors and stuff, so I don't know, I don't know. But I want to have that saved just in case I do need to update that given that that is where I edit all my videos and now run my Etsy from. <laughs> Thank you, I, I, was, I did orders last night. And I just want to thank you all for all of your support. Um, this community is absolutely amazing. And it was fun. I was a little nervous because I've never sold anything before on Etsy or anything like that. But once I kind of got the hang of it and um, Kelsey from Budget Better Life. Um, she was a big help with any questions I had and stuff, so I'm grateful for her. And uh, But once I kind of got into the hang of it and started printing labels and stuff, then I kind of figured it out fairly quickly. Alright. We are just going through and grabbing these all out. I need to get my sinking funds going because I just had to um, I just had to go to Walmart with my son and I think we were out of all household stuff all at once it was crazy I don't think that has ever happened to me like that before I mean I had I had to get all laundry stuff um, trash bags toilet paper paper towels all of my laundry stuff um, what else? Paper plates, paper bowl. It was crazy. I couldn't believe it. I don't think I have ever had everything run out all at once like that. Look at all this. This is what we saved from October until January. So I am so proud of myself. So let me get this money sorted. And then we will count it. And then I think I'm going to do sinking funds in another video. Just because this one's already probably going to be pretty long. And then I know the sinking, I know if like I add the sinking funds into this, it's going to be insanely long. How is everybody's new year going? On new year, today is new year. So this will probably come up or go up tomorrow. It's pretty late at night. I, I mean, technically it's January 2nd, to be honest. Um, but I still haven't went to bed yet. I'm a night person anyway. I work night shifts, so I'm used to being up during the night. So I don't count it the next day until I've gone to bed. <laughs> That's how I've always been. So anyway, we, um, we had a good, um, chill, uh, New Year's Eve at the house. Just me, my son, and my fiance. And then, um, here in our town, we're allowed to light off fireworks up until um, um, up until uh, 2 a.m. Oh my goodness! <laughs> See, you have Etsy now, and then um, and then all the notifications. I don't usually ever silence my phone because I don't ever get calls or anything, especially at the times that I film. So let me just silence that. <laughs> I appreciate the favoriting my shop though however um, so anyway we get to light fireworks off until 2 a.m. on um, New Year's Eve um, into you know the new year and on 4th of July we only get to light fireworks off until 10 p.m. and so we don't ever get through all of our um, fireworks that we purchase for 4th of July um, so we always have a build up, um, like, uh, like a basket thing. We always just have a bunch in there that we just rotate out. And so anyway, so the boys were having a really good time going through those and lighting off a bunch of fireworks. The neighbors got involved, so they were having a little firework shoot off, <laughs> trying to see who was the loudest and the best fireworks. But 
it was fun. It's pretty cold here in Iowa, so it was like 32 degrees last night. So I, um, we have a split foyer house, and so I just sat up in the living room on the couch and watched all the fireworks and the heat. I'm like, it's too cold for me out there, man. I'm always cold though, so. But they had a great time. All right, what did we save? for 2023 from October to January mind you so I think we did pretty good guys all right so we have one lonely $100 bill I did have um, $100 bills in some of the envelopes but come Christmas time we do a lot of gifts um, for like the nephews and stuff they would rather get cash than us going and trying to figure out a present and so I don't want to give them a bunch of 20 so I actually got 20s out of the ATM and then I I pulled my hundred dollar bills out of my envelopes and then replaced them with 20s so I need to I need to probably condense a lot I mean a lot of this is once I do my sinking funds then I will put probably put in placeholders for most of it so that um, a lot of this can get back to the bank all right so bear with me for counting here I still am wearing my um, wrist brace so we have 100 and then we have a 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500. Did I? Ugh. 20, 40, 60, okay. It's not the easiest to count in this little brace thing, but we're pushing through. My elbow's getting better and better by the day, so I'm grateful for that. All right, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So one, two, three, four. Let's just make piles. One, two, three, 20, 40, 60, 80. 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Oh my gosh, guys, we're doing, we did great. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. It is crazy when you do these challenges and see what they end up being. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. You just stay consistent with it and you can save a lot of money. I'm gonna move this. I don't think we need the cash tray. Uh, we'll set that up there. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60. 70, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 70, wait, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40. Come on, 40. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Perfect. And then all these ones. All right. This ought to be fun. <laughs> I can't even hold that. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What the heck? How did that happen? Oh, no. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that just like threw me completely off. Okay, um. Okay, let's just set that aside. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. So we have twenty five. <laughs> Six, seven, eight. So twenty-eight, thirty-eight, forty-eight, fifty-eight, sixty-eight, seventy-eight. All right. So seventy-eight. All right. So one hundred. Our lonely one hundred dollar bill. Okay. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seventy-eight. So we saved one thousand seven hundred and seventy-eight dollars from October until January. That is absolutely amazing. I really don't understand. I mean, I've budgeted for a long time. If you know my story, I used to be on YouTube a long, long time ago. Um, the budgeting community was a lot different then, um, but I never set aside this much for savings challenges. I understand that within the three years, my income has changed, life has changed. I'm a little more secure in my finances and just, you know, everyday life. So I am able to set more aside for savings, um, but, the extra that I'm setting aside for savings now versus before, I continue to do my budget the entire time off camera, but I started um, really crunching the numbers and really setting, you know what I mean? Like really honing in and putting more away for savings challenges because they're fun. And honestly, I can't tell you where all this money would have been had I had not been doing these challenges. So when people don't really understand why we play these little games, why we do all this extra stuff, um, when we could just simply throw it into a savings account, this are these are things that we need to we have to do in order to save more because it's then becomes a challenge and a game and it makes you want to do it. I mean, I can't tell you how many times I've been at the gas station and wanting to buy a bunch of snacks and I'm like, no, I would rather go home and play my scratch off games, you know? So I know that it's, I know that to some, this doesn't make sense, but to a lot of us, it is the only way that we can save the amount that we save. And so this is absolutely amazing. 1778. I mean, that's crazy. In this short period of time, I don't understand where this money would have been prior to this. But anyway, I, I want to kind of make just a short little video because I wanted to do the giveaway winner. I didn't want you guys waiting a long time because I know that you saved with us every day um, and you showed up for us um, girls for the countdown to the new year. Um, you got the freebies. You were there in the comment sections. You watched and a lot of you saved along with us and I loved seeing all those videos. I appreciate all of you and I just wanted to get this video out quick um, so that you know the ones that were saving with us are the ones that deserve to be in the giveaway. Um, and so um, anyway um, that is really all I have for you guys. Um, on the next video, I will be taking all of this money and it will be going into my sinking funds. And um, then we will start cash saving again in um, January. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to organize all my stuff, get my binder, my new binder set up, my new system set up for the year. And um, I just, I just want to tell you all that I love you so much. Uh, 2023 was an amazing year. It was amazing into my year, this community. I mean, I have made some true friends in this community and um, 
I'm just truly blessed and I just I just want to reiterate again how truly appreciated and grateful I am that you've welcomed me into this community and I hope you enjoy my videos. I know this is a long rambling one and probably not the funnest video I've ever made but it's a very important video. It's to close out the year, start off 2024 and just blow it out of the park. And so again, I just want to tell you all I love you so much. Thank you so, so much for continuing to come back to my videos, liking my videos, commenting on my videos. Um, it does not go unseen. I read every single comment that is ever left on my video and I appreciate you all. And that is all I have for you. Like I said, the next video will be um, doing my sinking funds probably and then um, savings challenges. So um, I hope everybody is having a great start to 2024. I wish you nothing but blessings, laughter, and abs like the absolute best year that it can be for you. And um, I will see you on the next one. Love y'all. See ya.